Hey, what's up everybody? This is Dom and today we are checking out the JBL OnBeat Micro for Lightning devices. This works with the iPhone 5, the iPod Touch 5th generation, and the iPod Nano 7th generation. And I'm pretty excited to get inside of this box and give you guys a little demonstration out there and tell you what I think about this lightning dock. Is it worth the money or should you pass and wait for something different? On the top of the box, we don't have much going on. Let's flip it around to the backside where we get some brief specifications made for iPhone 5. It will recharge the device when it's plugged in with AC power and it also operates via batteries here. As you you can see on the side you can connect to it using a lightning connector USB or the 3.5 millimeter audio jack on the back and it'll play music anywhere up to five hours on four AAA batteries so that's some pretty impressive battery life so let's flip it around to the other side here where we just have some barcodes and junk like that and nothing going on on the bottom so that was just a brief overview of the box but let's go ahead and check out the main event here let's open up this tab right here pull open the box and then we're going to go ahead and pull out this entire little cardboard enclosure where we see some instruction manuals and some safety stuff on the top. Let's get these open here. So the first thing we have is the quick start guide and you can kind of read through this if you need it. It's kind of straightforward though with this device and then we have important safety instructions. So be sure to read over those in case you have any safety concerns. All the cautionary information will be included inside of this huge manual here in all kinds of different languages. So let's jump into the main event. We will pull the top off this box and inside we have a little white box that contains the power supply for the JBL OnBeat Micro. This actually has a little adapter here as you can see as we pull it out of the plastic. It snaps onto this power supply here and I believe that's meant to allow this to work with many other outlets in different countries and I think you might be able to buy some adapters on the JBL website. I'm not exactly sure about that one but that's how that snaps on there. It comes on and off pretty easy and as you can see here this thing has a very long cable so it will reach to just about any outlet you need to make it to. So let's put this aside now and check out the main event, the meat and potatoes of this package. Here is the OnBeat Micro and as you may notice we have a little wiggle room on this lightning connector and that's meant so that it doesn't break off inside of your iPhone. But on the bottom here we have the battery plate and let's just snap this off here where you can see we have uh, the openings here for four AAA batteries and this does have some rubber grip on the bottom so it's not going to slide around on your table either which is a very good characteristic of this dock. So let's go ahead and look at the connectors on the back side here. First we do have the 3.5 millimeter audio jack and then we have our USB jack where we can actually plug in 30 pin or lightning devices to play music from the device there and then we also have our power jack which you can plug in the power supply to. So let's turn this around take a look at the front here as you can see, we do have two speakers right there in the front, and then we have the JBL logo. On the top here, we do have our up and down volume buttons, which will actually control the volume on the iOS device that's plugged into it, and then we have our power button. Let's go ahead and plug this guy in, turn it on, and get a little sound sample. We have that little bright white LED light on the top. Let's go ahead and plug in the iPhone 5 here, and I will give you guys a brief little demonstration as far as the sound quality goes. I know it won't be exact because it is going to be going through the microphone on my camera, but if this doesn't do you any justice, take my word for it. This thing pumps out some serious volume for how small it is. I was very, very impressed by the audio quality and the volume coming out of this little guy. So hold on, let me cue up this song here and you guys can take a listen. Now I know what you're thinking and it may not sound like much through this little speaker here but trust me it is very loud and as you can see this little wiggle here it may cause an inconvenience to some people it doesn't really bother me it kind of bounces back and forth but like I said that's to make sure that the lightning pin doesn't break off inside of your device it's kind of a safety net there and it helps it work with different style cases so this is the JBL OnBeat Micro for lightning devices and while we get another quick look at this, it's important to note that though this will work with cases, it will only work well with cases that have an open bottom design. Aside from that, I think this is a very well-made lightning dock and I highly recommend it. 
you can pick up the JBL on Beat Micro for about $99, and I'll be sure to drop a link down below in the description if you're interested. Also, be sure to let me know what you think about the JBL on Beat Micro down in the comments below. Thanks again for watching, everybody. This is Dom, and have a great day.